Let's go on to the Borda account and see who wins in this case. So Borda count. Now we've got only first through fourth place. So that means we have just one through three points, right? So third place will be one point. Well, really like fourth place, yeah, good point, yeah. Fourth place is zero points. Third place is one point. Second place is two points. First place is three points, right? Okay, so let's look at how many points A has. I guess maybe that shouldn't be an equals. It should be like maybe a colon or something. So let's see, we're gonna have 14 times three plus zero times, I'll just put a box here. That's for everything else, right? Yeah, we might as well not even worry about that because A doesn't achieve any points. So let's see, 14 times three is 42. Now let's look at B. So this is a little bit trickier. We're gonna have 14 times two for the first column and then 10 times two for the second column and then eight times one for the third column, right? And then four times two for the fourth column. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. And then no, four times three. Yeah, 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 thank you. Yep, four times three. And then one times one for the last column, right? And then what is that sum to? 69. So check it out, B is already winning against a. Now let's look at C, then D. And then maybe I'll just ask, what numbers did you guys get for those? And if everyone got the same thing, then we'll not worry about it. 67. Yeah. Cool. So 67 and 44. 44. Okay, this is a great this is a great example because look, we have another winner, right? We have our third winner, which is B in this case. So A won plurality, D won instant runoff, and B is winning the board account.